Hi, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Karu Izwan bin Abdul Aziz and currently I'm 18 years old. Recently, I just completed my SPM examination after several setbacks on its date. Alhamdulillah, taken a crucial examination during this hard time left an immense impression on my mental strength. For your information, I came from humble family in Feda Pumanes. I am eldest from four siblings but my parents managed to take care nine family members including my three disabled uncle. On top of that, my family daily income come from working as a harvester at oil pump plantation owned by others. From my perspective, this element does not weaken me but it made me more resilient to face the reality. Through evolving my family's socio-economic status, I'm confident that our beloved nation will be plunged into economical powerhouse in the region. Hence, I want to become as part of the powerhouse journey by becoming a professional. Thus, I choose to further my study in matriculation professional accounting stream as my foundation to become a chartered accountant. I am a very analytical person. I am very detailed in everything I do. I know that this failure is ideal for someone who holds the title of professional accountant. The skill of analyzing and making decisions from the finding is also a skill that I built not only in school but also in the world outside of school with the community. My mentor in the Duke of Edinburgh International Award Program and Award Pass in the United Kingdom is my role model. He taught me the meaning of living in organization and with community. He took me out of the cocoon of teenage cliches whose world was just around school or dorms. Through him, I learned the meaning of volunteerism. I also learned the importance to share what we have in life. I learned to organize things systematically, make decisions through research and see the world holistically. It led me to a different perception of a thing on basic and logical consideration. By the way, my mentor is Mr. Amrizam Abdurrahim. Moving on, my strength rests upon my superior engagement ability with my community. I built my learning module out of normal circle via several community and volunteer projects under Persatuan Belajit to Feda Pumanes. Working with a non-profit organization also opens up my mind and heart to the need of the people around me. Best thing that you can give to others is to give back. I have learned that there are times when you must take the sleep and when you need to take the back seat. I have learned to play as a team, work with people of a different age, gender and social status. From all of this, I'm awarded as a bronze and silver holder for the Duke of Edinburgh International Award. In Malaysia, it is known as Anugrah Remaja Perdana Raka Muda. Currently, I'm on a journey to finish my goal level. Subsequently, my overall weakness is I'm a totally perfectionist. Sometimes, I spend too long organizing over work to get it just right. This makes me spend a lot of time by doing one thing. But as a defense mechanism, I turn to activities that brought long-term benefit to myself. Other people can just do their own hobbies, but I have my own way. For example, when I am tired and stressed studying, I will teach others as well. So I follow by the education volunteer program by becoming a tutor in school. I also relieve stress by doing charity work. I am part of the welfare project team called Interkasi, focusing on helping those who need it. Online learning cannot happen perfectly if you are not prepared with the necessary physical equipment. We need a laptop, mobile phone, or any other compatible devices with a stable internet connection. For that, I fill my free time after the SPM examination by working part-time in order to raise a little fund to buy the equipment. Conducive, in my interpretation, is not just on the place. The conducive also lies in our mind, toe, and heart. So I'm ready to prepare physically and mentally conducive by setting the mindset ready for the long era of online learning. In a survey conducted by the committee to strengthen the accountancy profession, 64% of employers indicate they are Main criteria when recruiting accountants are candidates with professional qualification and relevant market experience. Now, this is not just a cry by the top accounting firm. The fact remains that a 
accountant is firmly rooted as a professional application, one that holds high standard and requires professional skills. I believe I'm a, I am the only one who builds soft skills, especially leadership and analytical in two real school and the community. I built this skill all through my role as president and my semester student representative person while at school. I also added value through extracurricular activities with the community through the Persatuan Village to Fedap Mane. I was given international recognition. I believe I'm one. I believe that I deserve to be selected for this one spot left because as a hard-working student, I will take advantage of this opportunity that the program will provide me. It does not weaken me if I'm not selected. I will continue to strive to achieve my goal as an accountant. I will continue my journey to get approval at the bachelor degree level in accounting by any means. After that, I knew I could get professional recognition like this SCCA. In the end, I will achieve it.